Florida Governor Ron DeSantis on Sunday refused to condemn a post that Elon Musk made on X endorsing an anti-Semitic tweet that alluded to a white supremacist conspiracy theory. During an interview on CNN's State of the Union, anchor Jake Tapper asked DeSantis whether he would condemn Musk's post that he said openly endorsed an anti-Semitic conspiracy theory that Jews are conspiring to replace white Americans with minority immigrants, noting that major companies such as Apple and Disney pulled their ads from X in response to Musk's endorsement. I did not see the comment, DeSantis said. I know that Elon has had a target on his back ever since he purchased Twitter because I think he's taking it in the direction that a lot of people who are used to controlling the narrative don't like. I was a big supporter of him purchasing Twitter, he added. I think they're obviously still working some stuff out, but I did not see those comments. Tapper then read the post aloud, in which a user said he was deeply disinterested in giving the tiniest s now about Western Jewish populations realizing that minorities that support flooding their country don't exactly like them too much. The user claimed that Jewish people have been pushing the exact kind of dialectical hatred against whites that they claim to want people to stop using against them. Musk replied to the post, You have said the actual truth. He went on to target the Anti-Defamation League, an organization that fights anti-Semitism, the ADL unjustly attacks the majority of the West, despite the majority of the West supporting the Jewish people and Israel. This is because they cannot, by their own tenets, criticize the minority groups who are their primary threat. The Tesla CEO's comments drew comparisons to the Great Replacement Theory, a racist conspiracy theory that Jewish people are conspiring to replace white people with minority groups. It's a lot of condemnation for singling out a specific religious group during this time of rapidly rising anti-Semitism, Tapper said, adding that you have been very out front when you see anti-Semitism on the left. Is anti-Semitism on the right something that concerns you as well? Across the board, DeSantis said. And, actually, I think, in the advent of these attacks, the amount of anti-Semitism that we have seen has really surprised me. DeSantis said he signed legislation in Florida that he characterized as an effort to combat anti-Semitism on college campuses, which has come under fire for its ban on pro-Palestinian student groups, before insisting that anti-Semitism is seen on both sides. The difference is that, on the left, that tends to be attached to some major institutional power, like some of our most august universities, he said. Whereas I think, on the right, it tends to be more fringe voices that are doing it. But it's wrong no matter what, he added. And I don't think that we have seen anti-Semitism this bad in the world probably since the Second World War. Tapper later mentioned in the interview that he still hadn't heard DeSantis condemn Musk's post. DeSantis again insisted that he hadn't seen it.